little more than an hour, a huge plane will take off mm. from DIA with some very important cargo on board. This is pretty cool. A team from Lockheed Martin is loading a highly advanced satellite onto that plane. And from here it heads to French Guiana and then into space. Denver 7's Nicole Brady live out of DIA this morning. Tell us about Colorado's involvement in this major project. Yeah, a uh, big project here, big day for this JC-17 satellite. And you can see right behind me here on the tarmac out at DIA. Crews have just finished loading up the satellite. They have to load a lot of other equipment as well. And this is the only plane that can really accomplish this feat because it is the largest cargo plane that's commercially available. It's a Russian-built plane. And as you said, it will be headed to French Guiana for takeoff just after 7 this morning. Uh, we just got some new pictures from the satellite being loaded up onto the plane. Uh, Lockheed Martin's program director tells us once this is in orbit, it'll be basically an advanced cell phone tower in the sky. Crew is at Lockheed's Waterton campus in Littleton have spent a couple of years building the JC Sat 17 for a Japanese telecommunications company. Uh, Lockheed has built five other satellites for this company, but this one is the most advanced yet. It has more solar panels, it's more powerful, and it has what's called flexible payload processing, which really makes a huge difference when it comes to cell phone coverage. Digitally processed payload, and what that really means is it gives them an awful lot of flexibility. Um, as their coverage changes, or uh, as I mentioned, as there's times of disaster, um, they can redirect service and bandwidth over the areas where they need it the most. And so that you can see back out here live, this plane getting ready to take off uh, sometime of around 7.15. If you're in the area, you might want to look up. You'll see this massive uh, cargo plane up in the sky. The launch for the satellite hasn't been set yet, but we're told it's ready to launch sometime in the next month. Live out at DIA this morning, Nicole Brady, Denver 7. Big morning out there. All right. Thanks, Nicole.